Hello guys, welcome to my channel. I am Akram and you are watching Knowledge360. In this video, I will show you how to develop a simple C calendar program using C language. Obviously, it is a mini project for you. You can develop through simple way a C calendar. So guys, in this calendar application project, there are three important operations are done such as to find out the day of corresponding to a given date you pass a given date and it will say which day to it belongs this is the first one and second one is to print all the days of a month like uh, like just like a calendar we see in mobile phones or anywhere else it it's like this there there's one more option and another option is to add notes to your calendar just like we do do we put reminders in our phone calendars so guys the coding is very simple and i have explained the, this whole coding through comment lines i hope you can understand it i am providing this source code in the video description link you can download it from there and also i i want you to improve this code and send me the improved code to to the mail id i am giving in the description see guys here i am taking two structures date structure and a remain reminder structure and another is only date structure so the all the things are um, explained here clearly i hope you can get it so let's start from the beginning by executing this code guys i am using dev c++ compiler if you don't have that one you can download it i am giving the video uh, i am giving the download the down, download link in the video description you can download it from there it's very easy and simple to down install and use so now click on compile and run This is the window of uh, our project now there are main three options finding out the day printing all the day of month like just like calendar and adding notes so first uh, I'm I will start from finding out the day I'm giving option one here so I need to pass the date in this format only suppose I am passing today's date that is uh, 8th of June 2020 so it should give me the day Monday as it is Monday to now we can confirm it from here as well from calendar see this is Monday now I am so see the, the day is Monday so we will see another one from from a day from past suppose I want to see the 10th of January 2018 so 10th of January 2018 was Wednesday so let's confirm this this is 2020 January and this is 10th sorry 2018 January 10th see 2020 January 10 was Wednesday so this is correct now now I'll show you by inputting wrong date format so like this you can have input like 35 in place of day you can put 35 but this is wrong let's see how this is handled so i'm giving 35th of 35th of june 2020 it should give me error message so see it said that it's an invalid date so again i'll show you by putting invalid month suppose the day is 8th and the month is 15 and the year is 2020 so this is obviously an invalid date so it says that invalid month value so like this it works now i'll show you by adding one note here by giving choice three 
so it's it says me to add note to the date date is dd and mm suppose i want to give note to near 1st of january so i am i can save it like uh, happy new year it's my note and it saved successfully so i am pressing any key to continue so note is also added now we will see printing of all date by giving the option 2 so i am giving option 2 here so now it asks me to give month and year to that which month and of which year i want to print like just like calendar view like just like this view i want to print all the day of uh, of a month so suppose i want to print of january 2020 so it will print like this now here are the options i can press n to see next uh, month next month calendar or p to see previous month calendar or q to quit this so see i will i will press n to see next year calendar february march april may june so let's compare this calendar with our existing calendar of june see uh, these are the sundays 7th 14th 21th and 28th see these are all same so our calendar is right we can also go back to previous month by pressing p here see we can see this way we can see any month like we are now at november 2017 so now i am pressing q to quit and this is the main menu so guys uh, these these are all about the calendar project is in c language i hope you like it if you find the video helpful please don't forget to like and subscribe my channel to get the updates of the project i post almost all kinds of project and you can see other c projects from the channel playlist here so so guys let's meet in the next video with another project explanation till then take care bye bye